the Need to Know Show, special report, Lysomal Storage Disorders, with Emily Nanneman and medical correspondent Renee Buckenberger. Cells, they're the smallest unit of life and they perform the everyday functions you need to survive. However, what happens when one of the cells stops working the way it should? Renee Buckenberger has this Even report. the smallest mutation in the cell can cause problems. Today we delve in the, in the mutations of a cell called a lysosome. For those of you who don't know, lysosomes are spherical bag-like structures that are bound by a single membrane and recycle old cells and turn them into new ones. When this cell mutates, it can cause bloating, skeletal deformities, clouding of the corneas, heart defects, and distortion of the face. LSD affects only 1 in 7,700 newborn babies. LSD is very rare. There are over 40 types of LSD, and they are all very life-threatening. Someone who has an LSD has a possibility of living up to three decades. Gaucher disease is the most common of the disorders, affecting about 1 in 57,000 people. It causes bloating of the liver, spleen, brain, and even the marrow of your bones. While silidosis, the rarest of the disorders, affects 1 in 4.2 million people. There's a wide variety of symptoms that have no relation to each other. I have with me here Tara Moreno, who suffers from type 1 Gaucher disease. Tara, at what age were you diagnosed? I was six years old. After years of suffering from a painful bloated spleen and years of misdiagnosis, I was finally diagnosed correctly. They used an enzyme S assay test, which is basically where you test my enzymes compared to the standard level of other people's enzymes. How would your family take this news? At the time, they were devastated. There was no real cure. The only thing they could do was try to relieve the pain. I took pain reduction therapy and had blood transfusions, but that, however, did little to mask it. But now things are looking up. I'm trying a new type of therapy, ERT, or enzyme replacement, replacement therapy, and, well, I feel a lot better. For those of you who don't know, ERT is a therapy that's main goal is to give the body the appropriate amount of enzymes needed to allow waste materials to be processed. Well, that's LSD for you a truly awful disorder that affects the lives of many people. My heart goes out to Tara or any other souls who have suffered from Gaucher's or any of the other 40 LSD disorders. Now back to Emily in the newsroom. Thank you, Renee, for a truly heart-wrenching story. In case you didn't know, LSD is caused when the lysosome lacks a single enzyme needed in the metabolism of carbohydrates, lipids, or proteins. It's a genetically passed on disorder. When we come back, is your goldfish trying to kill you? Stay tuned to find out.